Welcome to today's RxJS tip. In today's video, I want to show you the finalize operator. The finalize operator is a great operator to perform some side effects whenever an observable emits a final value. Therefore, it's typically used to perform some teardown logic. A practical example for the finalize operator is, for example, an HTTP request. When you perform an HTTP request, you often show a loading indicator. Now, whether an HTTP request has succeeded or failed, you want to hide the loading indicator. Such teardown logic is often done in the finalize operator. So let's take a closer look how the finalize operator can be used. In our example, we have a source stream that periodically emits a value. He does that three times because we use the take free operator. We then subscribe to our source stream and use an observer to lock the next value and lock a complete statement once the observable completes. So let's go ahead and use the finalize operator. And the finalize operator accepts a callback. In our case, we simply log finalize called. If you run that code, we see that 0, 1 and 2 gets printed by our next handler. Then the complete call happens. And then after the complete call, the finalize call happened. The same thing would happen if our source observable would throw an error. Many people think that finalize is only called on error or completion of the source observable. But it's actually called whenever a source observable emits a final value. So besides error and completion, there's a third final value that can be emitted. And that's unsubscribing from a observable. So let's store our subscription in a variable and then use set timeout to unsubscribe from our source observable after one and a half seconds. So we use one and a half seconds and then we invoke subscription.unsubscribe. If we now call this, we get zero and then we also get the finalize call. Finalize is a great operator to perform some teardown logic. It's called whenever a observable emits a final value. Final values are either a complete call, an error or a unsubscription. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel to not miss any future RxJS tips.